Hi everyone, thanks for joining us back here at Yachty. I'm Peter McTeer. Today I'm on Sydney Harbour. GT's at the wheel and we're taking you over this Seawind 1000 XL. She's called Beach House. Beach House was launched in 2007. And being the XL, she of course features the extended sterns, or extended transoms, and the self-tacking jib. It's quite a windy day on the harbour today, so we, we, we took refuge in Athol Bay and had a closer look on board Beach House. We love this super practical davit system, solar arch, barbecue area, seating area. It's just a really well thought out, and practical system. Jumping into the cockpit, loads of room, moves forward to that protected saloon area. You've got the opening windows here in Beach House. And there's also this canvas that divides the space. So the big practical inline galley is to starboard. So we're in the starboard hull here. Up forward, we've got a V-berth, Seating area, small dinette, table. Really quite large, deep refrigeration here to the outboard side. Private double, double cabin, double berth, sitting aft. And then in the porthole, we've got the owner's berth, the owner's cabin. Again, another V-berth. And aft here in the port hull, we've got the nice big head and shower space. Engines on Beach House, the high thrust Yamaha 9.9 .9 outboards, and they were replaced new in just 2022. Sails were replaced in 2019. We see the main here in the self tacker. All standing rigging was replaced in 2018. So Beach House really has enjoyed some of those significant updates of recent years. You can see the prodder up on the bow, so there's a furling screecher that comes with the boat. There's an additional spinnaker. The rear or dinghy comes with the boat with a 20 horsepower outboard. And Beach House was last, and he found in November 23. We had such a fun sail on Beach House today. These boats are a whole lot of fun, really flexible, accommodation space. Do get in touch for more details. We look forward to speaking soon. Thanks for watching.